I'm just near a place called Jericho in Tasmania. Uh, just outside Jericho, a fantastic story about how a thylacine attacked a man. Okay, attack at Pool Marsh. So here's a story I'm just going to read. It's from The Advocate, the 8th of June, 1872. Attacked by a Tasmanian tiger. A correspondent writes from Jericho, informing Hobart Town Mercury that on Saturday the 11th, a Mr. James Jones was proceeding along a road towards the lakes and when on the run known as Pool Marsh, he was attacked by a large tiger which came out of the scrub. Mr. Jones had a large stick in his hand and succeeded in keeping the animal off, but was followed by it for some distance of about half a mile. Mr. Jones says the tiger was the largest he'd ever saw, standing about five feet high. He had a dark collar and was different to the species of the common tiger, which was white marks across its back and a very yellow collar. Now, a couple of things there. Uh, white marks on the back. I think it's possibly talking about spotted tail quoll. Where it says collar, I'm wondering if this is probably the English accent that's just being recorded right, you know? Like, you know, we say colour, uh, but the English say cooler. Collar. So it sounds like collar, maybe. So it's a bit of a tall story. But as they say in Australia, never let the truth stand in the way of a good story.